want to continue with the thank yous. I want to thank Women's Civic League for this opportunity to come and speak to everyone tonight. I want to thank everyone who showed up. I want to thank Judge Murph for giving up your evening again and moderating this. And I want to say thank you to my fellow candidates. It, um, may not, we may not always agree on things, but it does take a lot to put yourself out there, a lot of sacrifice to want one of these positions. And I respect that. So thank you for putting yourself out there. I do think we agree on a lot of things, though. I have met one person in the city who doesn't agree on, we all want strong city services. We want strong senior services. We want strong police and fire. We want strong parks and rec. We want a clean lake. We want to move those young families in, and we want to fill up those vacant storefronts. I think we say that multiple times each every council meeting. I have not met one person in the city candidate or resident who doesn't want those things. So I just saved you guys some trouble with your intros by getting that out of the way. After being on council three and a half years, I've developed I, I, what it means to me to be a good council person. There are two categories, two components. There's things you do in office, things you do up in those chairs, or things you do when you answer a resident phone call or get those emails, things you only can do as a council person. And then there are the things you do that are, they're, they're I think, expected of you, but you want to do them too, even regardless of the expectation. Those are things that show you're a member of the community, not just a member of city government. For the things you do in office, I think you need to put the concerns of the residents first. You represent them, not administration. And sometimes you have to go to bat with administration to get your job done for the residents. You can't get rid of that. You have question, question, question before a dollar spent, before a contract signed or a law passed. You gotta let residents know what you're doing. And you have to make decisions like a judge for your eyes. Category to be a part of the community and volunteer, help out at events. You've seen me at a lot of events. You can read the booklet and see my other volunteer um, services. And I'm asking again um, for your support that I got the first time to return me up here so I continue for another four years serving the city. Thank you very much. Two minutes is now. <laughs>